Uh, I'm just trying to, <clears throat> excuse me, use this um, opportunity to remind myself that I had a golden opportunity to, I don't know, if maybe if I had spent a few hours. Uh, well, maybe I can do it for the other turns, but it just sucks that I could have, um, I don't know if I would have had time though. Okay, so what I'm going to be, uh, 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 well, first off, I'm really happy I finally got to put these freaking things on these um, fortresses. I'm going to have to color code them for me because even though they're like different letters, I'm like, eh, they're too similar for my mind. Um, yeah, I've got the Lots and Garrison Corps over here. I've got the uh, Konigsberg Garrison Corps, uh, Charles Tortoise is over here. Um, he's not going to leave. I was thinking, you know what? This guy's a smart little devil. He's been in, uh, he's been told to, uh, you know, strip all the fortresses of their garrison troops and get them ready for combat action. Um, and I did originally want to bring him back uh, down to Bromberg and direct the action from there. But I was like, you know what? He's smart. He's not going to do that. He's what a waste of time and resources, you know, moving his headquarters from there to there. Just, you're comfy, you're comfy there, let everybody else do their stuff. You've got things to do. That's why I'm looking at it. Uh, yeah, you don't see everything, but it, it's, like I said, it's more for me to remind myself that I had a golden, look, I've mentioned this before, Germans in this game, German rail, it's amazing compared to other people, but it's not a forever it's you know I, you can squander it and I've uh, I can look I've already used for this turn and I haven't even started they have a rail capacity of 12 I've used up 8 and I haven't done anything yet um, so this is what I'm gonna do and I'm just uh, what I need to do is get more core HQs in positions to uh, efficiently use uh, the rail network because right now I have um, I'm, I've bottlenecked myself and I didn't clue in. I'm not I'm not blaming Charles Tortoise. No no no. Um, I should have clued in ahead of time. I would I should have then started popping um, core HQs in. In other words, if I had spent a few more hours, and it would have taken hours, but th these are good hours. I like these types of hours. Um, and. What I'm trying to say, this was a golden opportunity for me to see this game or the way, like, to see the machinery going clickety clickety click. It's a giant version of the, um, that little conveyor belt thing of getting the, you know, um, spent troops back to the core HQ with some replacement units on the same turn. Boink, they go out like it's just this beautiful little fresh ones come back and replace. All, like it's just this beautiful little perpetual motion machine. Um, I had it right there in front of my flipping face, man. I could have been doing this little, you know. Uh, anyways, like I said, it can happen in the later turns. What I'm going to do, and like I said, I'm doing my own thing now. Um, so this turn, all the garrison troops are going to um, coalesce towards their... Um, uh, core HQ uh, recombination center, if you want to call it that. So the lots and groups, this guy's an S, I don't know if you can see it, but he's a special, there's, what, 24? Or, no, it's just eight. That's that's not lots in itself, or whatever it's pronounced. I'll have to look that up. Oh my god, and on a side note, I'm going to have to learn how to, and quickly, because I keep running into her, uh, uh, more often would be better. I ran into Bridget on the way home, uh, biking in and I had this well I had to stop I stopped got off my bike we chit chatted and she just talked my flipping ear off and I was like yay um, like we stood on the side of the road and just blah 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 blah, blah. and at one point I was like okay like you know it's like late you know I got, she's 91 man so I'm like okay like I can slowly bike with you like while you're you know you're pushing your walker and all that stuff man um, Ah, oh, shoot. Sorry, I'm getting uh, sidetracked. Yep. Uh, what did we talk about? Well, we obviously talked about World War II, Stettin, um Rail! 
Oh my god, she mentioned that, man. Um, why did she mention that? Oh, 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 oh. I, I, she was, uh, we started talking about the 1919 peace treaty. Oh, see what I mean, man? This is a crazy world. Um, anyways. So, th uh, this one is going to be, I'm not, they're not going to be used as part of the Lotson, uh, Garrison Corps. I'm using it as an S for special and also sneaky. Oh, I also found out, I didn't realize there's so, there was so much spying going on. Uh, I was reading the uh, Whizbangs and Woodbines book, and um, the guy's mentioning that uh, they had to occasionally tell uh, soldiers, like, you know, in the whatever's like, you know, like, just, it's good to, like, let loose, whatever, but you also have to remind yourself that, you know, you're like, blah, 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 people can hear what you're saying about, you know, oh, this is going on in the front, and so it, it was, oh, I was just like, what? Um... Anyways, so I'm using this to not let the Russians know that, by the way, everybody's leaving. We're keeping some here. And so that way, I, like, I don't want them thinking we're going that way is what I'm trying to tell you. So we also have, um, so Charles Tortoise has also set up the second um, uh, garrison corps here, the um, a Bromberg uh, garrison corps. Sorry, I did kind of cheat. I moved the uh, core HQ over to here. It doesn't matter. Relax. It's not going to be the end of the world. Trust me. When I start doing all these, you're going to see. So I'll take one turn to get all the garrison cores con concentrated to their recombination center. The next turn, they become combat ready. And the third turn, so 03 November, uh, so, sorry. Yeah, 03 November, hold on here. So that we get, they get popped here. Second turn, they get recombined. Or divisional break, you know, you, the whole nine yards. Third turn, they're ready, but I've constrained myself rail wise. You cool with that? I am. So I'm, in other words, wank, everybody gets strong in one spot, and then we uh, will send out the troops. It's also getting me to clue in yet again that this game is a. Uh, it's like stop motion. You have to look at each. It's going to happen, but just not um, in two turns or whatever. You have to, at least for my mind, that's the way I'm starting to clue in. It's taking enough, <laughs> a long time to clue in, but anyways. And then the third one is, uh, I, I'm, I don't know if you remember, I've, um, Charles Tortoise is also setting up uh, three reserve garrison corps that are going to be roughly equidistant. Here, I'll see if I can zoom out a bit more. Maybe that will help. I just have the camera at a very low uh, height. Here, hold on. But like I said, this is more for me to just remind myself that, God, I gave up a golden opportunity of, uh, I should should have put more core HQs, you know, to maximize uh, the amount of uh, rail usage. Like, already, I was even looking down here with uh, the Kriegfrosch. Uh, that's already screwed me. I can't move the Kriegsrosh uh, this turn because I've screwed them. Uh, these are, I think I mentioned it before, those t uh, double rail are taken up already. So I have to think about these things, man. Uh, but these are good, good things, uh, good things to think about. At least it is for me. This is, you know, one of the most uh, pleasurable parts of my, um, oh, it's, it's trying to solve a puzzle, man. Um, yeah, oh my God, it's going though. You know what I mean? Like, it's like, ooh. I get there, like it's starting to flow. I can start seeing where uh, things are going to start happening. Um, I already can see, um, you know, who's in charge up here with the 9th, 9th Army HQ. You've got the overall theater commander with uh, Hindenburg, but he's also in charge of 8th Army, so he's going to be uh, dealing with Warsaw and Wuj. And then you've got the new dude coming in there, Schubert. I think his name is. Hold on. Oh, no. Whoa, sorry. What am I saying? Worsh. The Worsh Army uh, down near Silesia, um, uh, Breslau. Um, he'll be taking over for Core HQ1 near the Tritown area. Um, and then we've got Borejevich. Sorry, man. That guy, I just love that guy to Dickens. I can't wait to do a special on him. That I can tell you that much. It's going to be a wonderful special. Um, yeah, and I mean, Borejevich is here. He's in Shemesh, just hanging out. I just think that's so, like, totally cool. 
Okay, that's it. Um, yeah, I'll go color code these things so I can try to figure out what the heck's going on. But, uh, oh my god, this has just been a flipping. It's going to be fun as hell. Okay, off I go.